Hello, everybody, and welcome to Live with the Lodge. I'm Michael, your host and mixologist, and this, of course, is Wiley the Wolf. Wiley, say hello to the, uh, the people out there. One of my favorite holidays is right around the corner. Do you, uh, do you know what that is, Wiley? It's Halloween! <laughs> exactly. And at Great Wolf Lodge, do you know what our version of Halloween is? If you do, tell us in the comments section below. What do you think it is, Wiley? And do you think that they'll be able to guess? Well, guess what? I'm just gonna tell you. It's Halloween. So let's do a howl for Halloween. And everybody at home, feel free to join in. You ready? <laughs> that feels good. <laughs> All right. Now, things are sure starting to feel a little bit spooky around the Great Wolf Lodge for Halloween. And we've got jack-o'-lanterns, cobwebs, a huge Halloween installation, sure to give you the heebie-jeebies. Uh, and of course, ghosts. What? No. Oh, we're, I'm just joking. <laughs> Don't worry about it. They can't, they can't hurt you. Listen, if that ghost comes back, make sure you comment to tell us you spotted it, okay? So today we're going to bring Halloween home to you by making some spooky mocktails and cocktails right from the bar at Great Wolf Lodge. Mocktails for the kiddos to enjoy and cocktails for the parents to relax with after a long day of trick-or-treating. And for the adults at home, you're welcome. Oh, and we're also going to be giving away a fun Halloween prize, including a $250 gift card. So make sure, right? $250. Make sure you leave a comment below for a chance to win. Now, Wiley, do you know what a mixologist is? No. People at home, do you know what a mixologist is? And if you think you do, let us know in the comments below. So, I'm a mixologist, and that means that it's my job to mix all sorts of tasty things together to create delicious drinks for people. And that's why I'm here tonight, to teach everyone three of my absolute favorites. So, I will be making the adult version of all of these, and Wiley over here will be making the mocktails for the kiddos. Are you ready, Wiley? All right, let's go. First things up, we're gonna be making our very spooky mule. For this drink, we're gonna need Jim Beam Apple Whiskey, Cruzan Coconut Rum, Finest Call Lime Juice, Finest Call Agave Nectar Syrup, and Ginger Beer, as well as Grenadine. And of course, lots and lots of ice. All right, so let's get started. Grab your shakers, and you can get all of these things at your local grocery store and liquor store. So we're gonna start off with the ice. Put a lot of ice, all right. Put it right here. Now, Wiley, is going to be making the mocktails, which means that he's not gonna be pouring any of the alcohol in there. So, when we do get to his portion of the cocktail mocktail making, he's just gonna have to add a little bit more ingredients to it, but I will show you. So, I will start it off. We're going to need 1.5 ounce apple whiskey. Pour it in like so. 0.5 of coconut, rum, there you go. And now Wiley, feel free to join in in the fun. <clears throat> so, we're going to do lime juice. Okay, put some lime juice in there. And remember Wiley, add a little bit extra in there because you don't have any alcohol. Great job. All right, some agave. This is actually, you know what? I'll take a little bit more agave. That there's for you. All right. Perfect. And now we are going to put the tops on our shakers and shake things up. But you know what? You can't shake things up in silence. So let's get a little bit of music, all right? Hit it. One, two, three, four. Good job, Wiley. All right, a couple extra shakes. Never hurt anybody. So we'll get the tops off of these right now. I will help you. Okay, yes, yes, I got it, I got it. And now, we're gonna grab our pint glass and we're gonna pour our entire cocktail or mocktail in the glass. Now we both need a little bit more ice. So, go back over to our ice bucket which is gonna be our best friend today. A little bit more for me, a lot of bit more for you. 
and we're gonna top it off with ginger beer. So, pop the top. Some ginger beer for me. Ooh. Some ginger beer for you. Perfect. Now Wally, can you do me a favor? Can you just hold that up to the camera real quick? Of course, we're gonna add some grenadine. And look how cool that is. Right? <laughs> oh, let me go. Perfect. Okay. Now, all that's left is to try it. Not only will we be trying it, we'll be cheersing. So everyone at home, grab your glasses, lift them up. Wiley, cheers. People at home, cheers. Yummy. Mmm. That is some good stuff. All right. And that is our spooky mule. <laughs> All right, so now time for mocktail number two. And this one is all about our favorite fall flavor, pumpkin spice. Now we're gonna be making our deliciously pumpkin-y pumpkin spike latte. Can you do me a favor? Can you count off the ingredients? Perfect. So we're gonna need pinnacle whipped vodka, rum chata, pumpkin puree, iced hot chocolate, which is just hot chocolate that you let cool down a little bit, and Coco Real creme de coconut. All right, and keep those fingers up because we've got a couple more ingredients. We've got whipped cream, fresh origins, pumpkin spice sprinkles, and a cinnamon stick. Good job, Wiley. Now this one is really simple to make because all you have to do is dump all of the ingredients in the tin. So, we're gonna start off. Now, like usual, I'm gonna start off with the adult version and I will tell Wiley when he can jump in. So, we will be starting off with 1.5 whipped cream pinnacle vodka. All right. Secondly, 0.5 of rum chata. Mmm, that is delicious. And, <laughs> all right. And now, Wiley, are you ready? All right. Now, remember, to the kids at home, you've got to add a little bit more ingredients in there to make up for the lack of alcohol. So, we'll start off with the pumpkin puree. Right there. Little creme de coconut. Finally, our iced hot chocolate. Pour that in there. Pour that in there. Perfect. Now, typically we would add the ice first, but for this one, we're gonna add it last. So, a little bit of ice for me. And a little bit of ice for my very furry friend, Wiley. All right, now, pop the top. And of course, if we're shaking, we're dancing. Can we get that music one more time? Ready? <laughs> one, two, three, four. Congratulations. You're getting better and better at this, huh? Perfect. And of course, always lending Wiley a helping hand. And we are going to grab our rocks glass and pour all of our ingredients inside. Perfect. How are we doing over there? We're good? Oh, we've got a little bit left. All right. Now it is time to garnish. We're gonna start off with some whipped cream. You. Perfect. And now, some of our pumpkin spice. Just on top. A little bit for you. More. And as Wiley has reminded me, you can put as much pumpkin spice on there as you want. Boom. Perfect. And finally, to just spruce it up a little bit, we've got a cinnamon stick. You can do this one yourself. Okay, I'll do it. All right. Look how beautiful that is. Ah, oh, makes me think of fall. <laughs> Can we taste this? All right, let's go. Yeah! 
Yum. Mmm. 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 That is good. Ah, that is fantastic. And that is mocktail or cocktail number two. Now, everyone, I've got a bit of a milk mustache. Uh, apologies. <laughs> But it's time for our final, last spooky mocktail. Now, how's everyone doing out there? Let us know in the comments um, which one's your favorite drink, okay? Now, this next one is definitely the spookiest, gnarliest, most terrifying drink at the lodge. It's called Bug Guts. <laughs> it's okay, Wiley, it's not really Bug Guts. It's gummy worms. So, for this one, like always, uh, we're gonna start off with ice in our tin. And while we put the ice in the tin, I will tell you what ingredients you will be needing. So, you're gonna need Minute Maid Lemonade, finest called Huckleberry Syrup, finest called Blue Carousel, as well as pineapple juice and gummy worms. All right, now, for the parents at home, if you wanna add a little bit of rum or vodka, to make this a fruity cocktail, feel free to do so. Okay, Wiley, let's get mixing. So we're going to use two ounces of all the juices that I mentioned. So two ounces of lemonade. Oops. But since Wiley doesn't have any alcohol in it, we've got to do a little bit more so that we don't have an empty glass. So we'll just double that up. Two ounces of pineapple, which means four ounces of pineapple for Wiley. You're getting so good at counting. I'm very proud of you. All right, now we're gonna use some finest call huckleberry. Again, two ounces for me. A little squeeze, I like a little sweeter. We're gonna really let it go for Wiley. All right. And then some blue carousel. Now, I'm just gonna pour a little bit in there for me, and none for Wally, because blue curacao actually has alcohol in it. Perfect. So, now, we'll top it off with a little bit more ice, because ice is our friend. Wally, can I have your tin, please? All right, there you go. Of course, pop the top. Now, for this last shake, I think not only should we dance, but we should spin as well. Can we get that music one more time? <laughs> one, two, three, four. Dizzy. Okay, all right, all right. Okay, good wolf. All right, team, this is what we're gonna do. Whew. We're done shaking. We're gonna pop the top to our tins. All right, of course, sharing is caring. Put this right on top. Oh, wow, that is amazing. Don't be shy. There you go, Wiley. More ice for the wolf at large. A little bit more ice for moi. Okay, now comes the buggy part. Grab your gummy worms and put them at the top of your drink so it looks like they're crawling out, huh? <laughs> I'm just playing. All right, look at that. How scary, how spooky that is. One more. This is for me. And of course, we've got to taste it, right? Straw for you, straw for me. Let's go. Ready, set, go. Mmm. Mmm. That is refreshingly buggy. Huh. All right. Well, folks, so that's it for our spooky mocktail mix off. And all of these recipes can be found at our Great Wolf Lodge blog link below or stop by the bar at any of our locations. Now, before we go, let us know what your favorite mocktail was in the comments below. What about you, Wally? Which one did you like the most? Mmm, yeah. that one was very delicious. 
I think I liked the bug guts, because I like to have a little snack when I'm drinking, you know what I mean? Mm. All right, well, thanks again for joining us, and we hope your Halloween is extra spooky and full of tasty treats and a few tricks. Hopefully, we get to see you at the lodge this Halloween. Can we howl one more time? <laughs> and don't forget to leave a comment for your chance to win a howling great Halloween prize. Should we dance our way off? All right, let's go, team. Can I get song one more time? <laughs> Ready? <laughs> one, two, three, four. Bye, everybody.